that's that's totally fine. If you want to go a little bit low and deep, you know how you know you know him better than I know him, and I don't want to reinvent the wheel unless I do something I think, oh crap, that's not going to work. I'll just I mean I'm just starting with my lateral stuff, but if you yeah. want to see something would, else, no, nope, that's fine. And just give a little more time to the left. Give yourself permission to get there. A little bit more control the very base there. How's that? Is that okay? Okay. There you go. Doesn't that feel better? And I think you have to be really careful not to go too long in exactly the same bed. You gotta bring that neck a little bit, loosen, loosen the neck a little bit at the base. Like that. Feel that? Yes. Don't go within about more than about ten steps or so, maybe reversing your bend or playing a little bit in the bending changes. And if any of this sounds like the cake that won't work, just use your words and tell me, okay? <laughs> Now, he wants to bring his left ear more nope. to the left than his nose. So let's work a little bit on making sure you have control of the base of the left side of the neck. And that's where he's stuck, is right at the base of the neck underneath your rein. Right where your rein touches his shoulder. Try to get him through there. You'll feel it, yeah? You're getting in there because he's telling us you're hard. Get that plate control that there. Feel that? Yes. So even if he gets a little deep, take your time and get to that spot. There, you still you still have it. So when you go to your piece of lateral over your shoulder and your hunch again, keep control of that part. There, feel? Yeah. Then he goes over and out your left rein rather than in and drop. There, feel? And now your engagement floor is going to go up because you're more active behind. Yeah, I know. I, I mean, that's where you get. Stable, stable. Again, get that place in the neck. And then being in the blanket and up and press it. Do that one more time. Let him move you. Feel like you can casually take that left rein and increase and decrease the bend. Good. 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 And that you can work that bend. Go left again. And then you can go all the way across if you want to because this is really about warm up. And what I want you to do is feel like you can increase and decrease the left bend. Yes. Good. Good, then a half pass again from K, fair enough. Oh, in the very tip of his neck. I know it sounds really weird, but especially the left side. Diesel. There, now bend more without losing control of the tip of the nose. Now bend less without losing control of the tip of the nose. Well done, you go right, we'll do it one more time. Does that make sense? Yeah. There, now you're still on the outside range, feel? Yeah, I know. Yep, there we go. There, there, feel? Now you have his back. Bring that half pass one more time. And again, what you're really focusing on is the ability to bend and unbend without having to let go of your outside ring, okay? So I turn a little bit here. I leg yield out. And I half pass back with my right ring. See how that works? You establish your bend in the corner. You push them out a little bit. And boom, your half pass works every single time. Super. Turn left, leg heels out, inside, 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 and side, let's go. Pretty cool, huh? Yes. Yeah. Okay, I'm on. We'll do it one more time just so you get the feel. And out. And in. And then go watch your favorite rider and see if you don't see them do that in the past. But they use that corner to set up the bend. And walk. And Super. Good. And then collect. And you can pirouette on this one if you feel like it. Get small. Good. And start to turn it. Get relaxed. 
and turn it, and turn it. That's a girl, there you go. And if you can get a little more collection before you start your turn, the pirouette will stay more on the line. Does that make sense? But the problem is you're coming in and you're losing a little collection as you start the turn and then he comes off the line. But that's okay, that's the way they all start. You watch that all the time. And a walk, and I hold that. But keep the neck low, so you don't, that's it, keep the neck low. Now collect in a nice way. Now, but you need to go straight up, get out again. I want you to get, I want you to ride better collection on your quarter, on your diagonal before you turn, okay? okay. I'm not being mean. I just don't want him to start turning the minute he feels you, the minute he feels you collect, he starts to turn, and I don't want him to do that. I want you to go straight. Good. And then I want you to collect and hold the collection. No, collect, not hop up and down. Uh, now turn it. Yeah, there you got some at the end. That was fine. Now straighten, organize, double clock, and change. Like that. That was so no. much better, right? Okay. We're going to canter two quarter lines just to kind of get everybody on board. Good. Good. And then turn again. You have to take weight. You have to take weight. You have to take weight. There we go. Super. Borderline. And then I want you to think. Double clutch change. Get your time. Good. Double clutch change. There you go. And double clutch change. Get up there. Well, they were both clean, but you could tell he, yeah, it's okay, come straight. No big deal. But do you see what I'm trying to do? Your timing on one of those, your timing on the second one wasn't as good as your timing on the first one. But this is going to help you get into that little package in for the step, for the prep step and the change, because okay. those are two separate things, right? Prep yes. step and change, right? Okay. The cluck cluck is prep step. Yes, you got a good prep step on that one. Come back. It is helping, that's okay. He just didn't hold the prep step. He didn't stay back enough. That is super. But did you feel that? Yes. He has to stay back. And part of you going into that right chain or to that left change, let's go over the reins a little bit. Or he leaves. I don't care which one it is. Somebody's doing something. Yeah, okay. 